Okay, sorry about that. I accidentally hit the. This is uh, number two out of this out of this video series here of State Fort Stevens State Park. I accidentally hit the uh, pause button. So someday I'll figure out how to edit videos. Probably be retired then, but some people it comes natural to, and other people you just don't want to fool with it. You know. <laughs> I mean, you'll do it, but you gotta have plenty of coffee and enough time. There's a lot of things like that. All right, I'm gonna go to the right. Um, doesn't exactly, oh, it says right up there. Shipwreck. Yes, yeah, so we'll do the shipwreck. Get it over that direction. Peter Iredale. I do not know where the boat was made. Iredale is spelled I R E D A L E. I R E D A L E. It's very pretty, though. See how forested it is in here? Very nice. Bus. School bus. It's a school bus from Napa Schools? K-N-A-P-P-A? -P -P -A? I have no clue where that's at. Napa. K-N-A-P-P-A. -P -P -A. Napa? Napa. I don't think it pronounced the K. Coffinbury Lake and uh, Columbia River. We'll, uh, I'll drive over there to this uh, lake, and it's called uh, Day Use Only. North picnic area. Oops, gotta go the other way. Well, here's the lake right there. I'll show it to you here in a second. That little piece of paper is covering up the viewing side of the camera. Not your side, but my side. So I have to look to see kind of how everything's sizing up. That's a pretty nice lake there, see? I wonder if that's the name of the team. Oh, look at that. Isn't that cool? I didn't see that when last time I was here. I would imagine you could probably... Kids don't float, it says. Wear, wear a, a life... This would be a nice place to take a kayak. Very pretty. Hmm. Now what did I say the name of the lake was? I must have short-term memory. <laughs> it's called, uh, I don't remember. Uh, well, I have to go over there and read the sign. Whatever I said three minutes ago. <laughs> I can read the back side of this sign on the left. You know, if you ever do that, what does that sign say? And then you crank your head around to see what it says going the other direction. Coffinberry Lake. C O F F E N B U R Y. Coffinbury Lake.
Uh, Columbia River Battery. Okay, and this is says the ocean. Oh, that's where the Peter Iredale wreck is. So I'll show you off in that direction. The Peter Iredale wreck. It says I can go 25, so I'll go 25 instead of doing 10. Off to the left there, the, that's where the trail is, the one I was, the Mosquito Trail, I call it. It has a name. It's the trail that goes to the Peter Iredale wreck from the campground, for those people that like to walk. You ever have a sound and you can't figure out where it's coming from? It's coming from the radio. And the reason I couldn't figure out where it was coming, there's the Pacific Ocean. Yep. I'll take this out of the holder and get really close to the wreck, and then I'll be a nervous wreck. <laughs> That's a bad joke. Hmm. I think I'm going to go up to the other one because it looks like the beach access. Do you see how it's sloped right here? And there's a big sand bank right there. I'm not going to be able to get up that. So I'm going to go to the other access point. Plus there's a big, uh, there's a big uh, puddle of uh, water. And yeah, yeah, I'm just not going to do that. Likely fall on my ash, ass in the sand. As the British people call it, arse. All of my arse. One thing about beach access is you have to be careful. Sometimes uh, you'll get stuck. How's that for a view? Guy just sitting in the... It's a very nice day. It's not hot. It's not cold. The wind's not blowing too much. You can see right there to the horizon. There's something about looking into the, the edge of things. Just kind of makes you feel small. So I'll get out and walk around here for a sec. I'll continue this video with the walking part. <laughs> 